all right guys welcome to my youtube channel this is naja prior crazy tips here we'll talk about how you can create mobile app not just that how to also make money online and also how you can solve ads related issues so what well, today we are going to talk on how you can remove ads limits on your google admob dashboard and also how you can prevent your account from um, receiving uh, ads limits so um please if today is your first time of visiting please do where to subscribe um just do it to subscribe because here you can see some other problem that you can use to solve your own problem <laughs> you know what i mean when you see the problem that you can use to solve your own problem it's still something something i will need to take off so now we are going to talk about it uh, and you can see this at times when you build your mobile app and you will then notice that this ad submit limit have been placed on your uh, admob account so it will give you sleepless night especially if you just a kind of it, you have trusted this admob and you really want to make money from them and they all of a sudden others are posting their earning on facebook and other social media and you say okay let me just uh, try this people let's see what will happen and all of a sudden you start getting this kind of a thing and this thing you see that it can take almost a week getting to a month so at times two months for this thing to disappear you understand so but today i'm going to show you the quickest way the quickest guide for this to to disappear on your dashboard so what are you going to do i'm going to teach you the two different ways you can do this first of all you have to do what check your ad unit select the, the kind of app the particular app that you you're working on and then click on this um, add unit here are the units the add units here are the add units so what are we going to do we are going to start removing them just click the boot and do what you remove them by clicking here you remove have you seen it then once you remove it like this what else are we going to do we're going to leave this particular um dashboard for two to four days then come back and check if this particular ads limit have been uh, removed so and uh, after that there are other ways you can also do that is by clicking at this feedback button here once you click on this feedback and um you're going to see this this going to appear so what are we going to do we are going to click here to highlight or hide information let's click here we are going to give them a screenshot of our ad mob let's click on it like this you don't click done 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 it's going to capture everything there you see to show them that something is wrong here you can give them a feedback you can say hi um add mob uh, thing i so 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 things i received the uh, ideas limit in my dashboard and uh you people should please assess my traffic check my traffic quality and uh, reactivate my account just try to let them know that this ad serving limit is also affecting people that are using your app are you getting it then just you know what i mean something like that just fix it and then send them once you send it to them they are going to assess your traffic and also reply to you as soon as possible at times even if you do this you send this to them they will not reply they will not even do as if you are the one you are talking to are you getting it what you have to do is just to exercise patient at times this will take like two to three months for them to remove this particular thing you see like this now this shouldn't be the main issue what we are supposed to concentrate is how to prevent this from being uh, on our dashboard or having it in the future time are you getting it so to do that it's very simple but very hard to do stop sharing your app link on social media one thing you should know about google is that provided that your app link 
yes uh, inside uh, play store any part any place that you paste that particular link are you getting it they are still going to do what to trace it and then notice how and where you pasted the link have you seen the problem now so that is the main reason why you should not try to do what to paste the link there instead of that tell them that this is the name of the app and you know that particular one is even the main reason why they are going to ban your account so the main thing is make sure you build your app publish it on play store leave it like that don't tell anybody about your app make it anonymous and don't let anybody to know that you are the owner of that app that is the only correct way that you can do what you can stop all this blah 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 blah, blah on your dashboard have you seen what I'm talking about now? So, what next are we going to talk about? Try and do this. Um, two, three different ways is make sure you send, you remove the ad unit, um, make sure that you send feedback to them. And another thing is you make sure you don't share your app on social media. Make sure you don't tell your friends about your app just do your app in such a way that nobody will notice that this particular app belongs to you all those kind of a thing then once you check your dashboard and notice that all these ads have been limited has been removed then you can now create a new ad unit and then go to your app creator and integrate your ads then it will start moving so my times even when you uh you after when they remove this ad serving limit now and um, you create new ad units once you integrate it immediately they will serve you another limit have you seen it so at times once you notice that you've gotten a limit uh, you have been limited from this particular app within that period of that ad serving limit which has been placed on your ad mob use that opportunity to build another app forget about the other one that is the reason why it is good to use two different ad uh, network so that each one that you've gotten such uh, stuff then you implement it to like I, I prefer start up just copy startup ID and then place it there all of a sudden everything will just start working you'll be making your money even though they place this ad serving on your your dashboard then use that opportunity to create new app then immediately they remove this ad serving you create new um you create new ads unit and then integrate it into the new app it, everything will start working perfectly then you continue creating new app you are not going to get this ad serving limit again so this is this dashboard is uh from a friend so i'm going to you know try and um, remove it for him so if you have any other issue related to this stuff you can just do it to drop the comment at the comment section ask any question i'm ready to answer you and if the problem is beyond we can do a video to show you guys how you can do it and how to solve it so in this particular place you can request for video and we'll give you the particular video that you requested for thank you for watching and may god bless you